Hi, I'm Jim Dodson. If you or someone you know has been injured in some type of accident involving a city, county, or state government, governmental entity, you have to understand that dealing with them is totally different than dealing with a standard insurance company. Uh, most of these governmental organizations do not want to settle cases, period. Uh, we found, quite frankly, most of the time we end up having to file a lawsuit in order to hold them responsible. I'll give you an example which is sort of typifies dealing with uh, county government. Had a gentleman who was injured in an accident, in our view, clearly the uh, government's responsibility. The first thing they did when we put them on notice was to find a way to try to blame another entity for it. When they couldn't do that and they realized it really was their property, then they deny, ultimately denied liability for the claim because they said it was something that the person had done. In other words, if they had been looking more carefully, if they hadn't gone in a particular place, they wouldn't have gotten injured. So first they try to find someone else, then they deny responsibility. So they leave you in a position where, um, in our view, the, those arguments are not very good, but you have to file your lawsuit in order to hold them responsible. Um, they know that they're dealing with tax dollars. They rely on the fact that juries understand they're dealing with tax dollars. And that tends, in their view, to hold down what they may end up having to pay out ultimately for the value of, of a claim. Uh, we handle these claims. Uh, they can be held responsible, but they're just different and they're handled differently than with a standard insurance company.